Hello YouTube and welcome to another TextLaws video. Last time I showed you all the new features of Android 4.3 Jelly Bean. Uh, I've already talked about that deep in the system there's already the feature that you can deactivate special app rights. Until now you needed a common launcher to go there, but times have changed. So now you can, there's some uh, apps in the App Store like Apps Op. Um, you can download them, they don't need any special rights. I've already done this here on the new Nexus 7 and my old Nexus 4. And if you start it, you get a list of all your installed apps on your device, like Google Maps here. And then you can see, get the special, um, which rights does this app need? So location, of course, for Google Maps. Or let's check out our phone app here on the Nexus 4 phone. So contacts, uh, calling list and all this stuff. So basically everything you need for your for your phone app. Uh, on the other hand, why we got, where do, 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 did we put it? Instagram here. You can see Instagram needs your location, your contacts, your camera and your voice audio recording. Um, and you can already so see when did it use the special rights the last time. And then you can try to yeah, get rid of some uh, Ads uh, rights uh, you gave the app, and uh, because everything, uh, uh, every time you download an app from the App Store, you have only two choices: give the app all the rights it wants, or don't get the app. With this nice little trick, you can get rid of some app rights, maybe a contacts list or so. Why does the picture app need to know your contact list? And uh, but keep in mind, this is uh, you try this out on your own. The apps are not designed to remove special rights from the app, so don't um, freak out if your app does not work anymore. Um, just play around with this, get to know which app needs what, which rights, and uh, have fun with this. See you guys in the next video, and bye.